Welcome back! And don't you dare make fun of my voice, I'm still sick, okay? Anyway, the Alice spam continues with the tutorial of my largest prop, the hobby horse. Just an FYI, my hobby horse was based on both the art and the in-game model. I basically combined the best elements of the two. It was the trickiest to craft and I even had to take some days off because of it. And that because I exhausted my arms, we're we talking about 5-6 to six hours of sculpting every single day, so don't be like me, rest! Give your body a break! So let's begin by talking about the measurements. I am 165, so it was made according to my height. So the entire hobby horse is 135 uh, meters tall and 50 centimeters wide. The head is 37 centimeters thick and the handle is again based on me and my tiny hands. <laughs> so what is it made out of? The majority of it is made out of my trusty dusty blue styrofoam. The handle is basically a PVC pipe that has blue styrofoam on top. I will explain the rest in a bit. So as you can see, I first started making the head by stacking a lot of thick styrofoam layers and glued them together with this paste that does not melt it and did the same on its tail. Um, I will call it a tail for now, unless I find another word for it. After loads of tears and sweat, I sculpted it down to this and made it smooth with a sandpaper. Then I filled in the gaps using acrylic putty and sanded that down as well. I repeated the same process on the rest of the pieces. This is the part that goes right below the head. These are the ears. This is the tail, and these are the pieces that will go over the PVC pipe to give it a spine-like look. I then sealed every piece with multiple thick layers of wood glue. Then I started putting some details with um, 5mm of EVA foam. And after everything was sealed with wood glue, I primed it with even more layers of gesso. I then painted everything with black acrylic to create a nice base and painted the details with silver acrylic. That's a tongue twister, so silver acrylic, Sil silver acrylic, okay, I'll start. Right next, I painted the eyes and the nostrils red and as you can see, I made two cuts under the eyes and that because I installed LED lights in the hollows of the eyes and hid the battery in the mouth. In order for the light to spread out nicely, I added this almost um, transparent red plastic. Back to painting! The rest of the hobby horse was painted using a mint colour that was dabbed with a sponge in order to give it some dimension. Lastly, I applied a glossy varnish on the entire hobby horse. And that's pretty much it! Like the video and don't forget to watch the rest of my Alice series. Please subscribe to my channel, I upload videos every Sunday. Thank you very much for watching and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye bye!